Hey guys, welcome to my video. So today, this will be a follow up from my previous video from a few months ago from how to install mods on the PlayStation 2 or GameCube Spider Man 2 game. So, in that video, I showed you how to play in 60 FPS, 4K with little to no lag. So, there was a few people asking me on that video how to add uh, different suits like this one is the Iron Man's spider suit did I say that right? Iron Man, Iron Man suit something like that anyways and how to add different controller layouts so today I'll show you that so let me just exit this game real quick. Okay, so in my previous video, I showed you how to download the files to uh, mod your game. So if you don't have them yet, I'll leave them linked down below. What you want to do is open two file pages. <clears throat> so let's open one on each side. First, what you want to do after you download, make sure you create a game mods folder so it's organized and you don't lose them. If you tend them, if you tend to change your suit very often or mod your game, just make sure you keep like a separate file for it, just so it's nice and neat. So my Spider-Man 2 mods is in this folder. So I got the HUD layouts, the main textures, which would be the buildings, etc., suit mods, and these are all the different suits that are available at the moment. There might be some new ones out, but that's the one they had when I downloaded it. Different webs as well for different types. Um, Different HUDs, if you want to mess with it, I just kept the original one, but in HD. You can, I can, um, sorry, you can change your controller layout too. It's from Xbox to PlayStation 3 or even PlayStation 4. So what you want to do is, if you want to change the suit, go to the suit mods, leave this open. If you already have Dolphin, and the game installed what you want to do go to documents go to dolphin emulator load textures and this should be the code for your game for the spider-man 2 game if you don't see anything here just create a new file with this <clears throat> And then you would dump all the files from the main textures in here. Copy and paste it. Once this is done, then you can um, change your suits, change your HUD layout. You can basically mod it however you like. So if I want to, let's pick something here. Uh, Deadpool. It's very simple once you get the hang of it. You just copy it, come to this folder, paste it. It's going to say this every time you replace, um, every time you want to replace your suit because they all got the same names, but it's different textures. So just replace it. <clears throat> so let's go back to the game. I've got a quick save on it, so let me just quickly refresh. And look at that. There's that pool. So basically, it's the same procedure for everything else. Um, apart from the main textures, it's it's pretty simple, really. So you can change the suit whenever you want. You can change the HUD whenever you want. 
you can change the controller layout but just make sure when you open it if it has more than one file that you copy all of it otherwise it might you might find some bugs no pun intended <clears throat> anyways i hope you found this video useful if you liked it leave a like leave a comment if you got any more questions um just leave it down below and i'll try to make a video to to help you out okay see you